We're gonna be the day before the full moon. If there's a day where like a couple big females should roll up, it's tomorrow. It doesn't take much. Like, it takes one good pocket. I, I probably just need to stick to my strengths. And that's sight fishing. I didn't catch a big one yesterday. At some point, I've gotta catch a big one. Land this one, we're going to knock that one too. What up, dude? Record, go, bro. All of this content on the Trimmed Up series is brought to you by ARE. If you guys are looking for a bed cover or a truck cap, it doesn't matter what kind of truck you have, ARE will custom build something for you. I've got the Z series on my truck. I've been running this one truck cap for five years. It keeps all of my gear safe and protected. If you guys wanna find out what truck cap fits your truck, make sure you check out 4are.com. Without them, we couldn't bring the Trimmed Up series to y'all. He actually owes me 200 bucks, so I'm gonna oh. talk to him here in a second. Well, there you go. Hey Dustin, you got that cash? Got it right now. Do you? He said, he said, Dustin won't have 200 hey, cash. The other day I was like, I can still gotta pay him. I had to see him. You show up four minutes before the takeoff every day. No, you gotta sign one of them. Oh, I do gotta yeah. do that. Thanks for the Chad Shad DC. I gotta, I gotta sign this for my guy, but I'm gonna yeah, hand it to you because I'm gonna forget. Yeah, of course. Get with me. I'll, I'll, I'll find you at the end. Yeah, I'll find you at the end of the day. Go I'll find you. Bag <laughs> I'm gonna sign that. <laughs> I might sign. If I catch a bag, I'll sign it and give it back to you. If I catch what you caught the first day. This has got to be good luck. I've got his money. So we've kind of got a one-two punch today. We're going to be looking for sight fish all day. And if we find them, the Bellows Shad, Bellows Gill, and a Wacky Rig is going to be our go-to bait. If we don't find them and while we're looking for them, we're going to sling around a swim bait all day. We need some quality bites. I know some guys are catching some big ones on it this week. So I'm going to commit to this a little more than I did the first day. I didn't throw it a ton, but we'll just have a little bit different approach. You know, when I see one, we're going to lock down on it. And hopefully, you know, the full moon is tomorrow. The female should be up. What's What's gonna spawn should be spawning right now. And we've got, for now, a perfect sight fishing day. Need that one. Post spawn, ugly one, but I'll take him. Look at there. That is an ugly fish compared to some of those other ones. But three pounds, one ounce. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't catch one that had like that big of a frame the whole first day. <laughs> Pretty crazy how many locals there are on a day like today. I mean, I know it's beautiful, but dude, it's a, it's a Wednesday. That many people on spring break right now or what? <laughs> Here's a nice one. Not on a bed, just up here cruising. Right where I just brought my swim bait through and didn't bite. Not this pocket, but the one after it, I saw two fours and a five in practice and they were both gone. So while this is new water, it's not a new area for me. Big one. I didn't see that one. Gosh, 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 gosh. You're good right there. You don't have to move. I'm gonna reach down and go. All right, now we're, now we're cooking. Go, well, I threw my bait up there and I go, oh, there goes one cruising off and I reel my line up and he's got my bait in his mouth. There you go. Three pounds, 13 ounces. All right, that's a good one. It's not a bad fish. Oh my God, there's a, there's like an eight pounder. That fish is huge. It's not an eight, but it's like a five or a six. Dude, I need that big one. She's not really sitting, but like, good grief. He's getting it before she can. He didn't want her anywhere near it. Dang it, I got him outside the mouth. Crap. I got him outside the mouth. Look who found her. Dang it. Dude, he thumped it and I just mm. I know how I know I love this game because man now I'm freaking shaking. God dang it. That was him. Still it's a three and a half pounder. You know what I mean? Like what am I doing? Oh, he's probably not catchable now. I might have just wasted an hour of my day on these two stupid fish for nothing. I think she's in the mouth. In the mouth. We got us a four pounder. She wasn't quite as big as I thought she was, but she'll go four. Five pounds, zero ounces. Something like that, baby. Five pounder. Let's take a picture of that fish. All right, the old bellow shad, baby. Let's go find the next one. 
I just should have been done there in about half the time and caught both of them, you know? That's just, how I was, that's why I was mad. I'm three pounder away and we make it. Somewhere between five and a half and seven. Big, big fish. He's like really, really into her. Like he might've just locked her on. She's nosing on my stuff right now. Let's she go. bit it. Let's go with him first. Nope, she bit it right there. That's her. land this one, we're in the knockout, guaranteed. Now you have. Inside, oh, baby. Inside the mouth, Let's dude. Go. That's like a 5'10", probably. 5 pound, 12 ounces. Yep. 5 12. Mm -hmm. Let's get a picture. 5'12". 5'12", okay. 3, 2, 1. Lines out into period 3. All right, not a bad deal, huh? point across from there there's a dock on it and I kid you not there's 25 over three on that one dock I skip my mag draft up there and reel it and I'm like okay <laughs> I'm definitely dehydrated how's it going Can you see my hat? yeah absolutely I got your dad's signature yesterday is that right where's it at I'll sign over right, it I'll sign across it <laughs> did you have luck today yeah I had a good day good. good day we actually we got a good side fishing day like almost none of those fish that I caught today, I probably could have caught in a, on a cloudy day. I didn't find any more like big ones that I'm excited to go look for. I've got some fish that I'm definitely gonna revisit that seem dumb, but I think they're three pounders, not five pounders. And we need five pounders, because now weights are zeroed. We need to try to win the thing. And all of a sudden, I kind of feel like we've got a chance. I mean, I don't have the winning fish found, but I, I've got a hunch. Got a little bill of shad after a workout today. Caught one of my five pounders on it, a couple other three pounders. My wife is literally nine months pregnant. She went to the doctor today and the doctor's like, I can't believe you're still pregnant. So that's how close we're cutting it. I'm in South Carolina, she's at home. And so yeah, we're hoping baby holds off for a couple more days. I was kind of, I'm not, I wasn't hoping I didn't make the cut. Part of me was like, eh, if I don't make the cut, Tyler and I are gonna drive all night and we're gonna make it home. But now we kind of found us some fish. Kelsey's excited, but she's also sad, but I'm just praying he stays. Stay inside just a little longer. It's warm in there. I want to thank ARE for helping us bring you the Trimmed Up series. And if you haven't seen the last episode of the Trimmed Up series, make sure you click it up here. And you're not going to want to miss the next one because we're going to catch some bass.